8 and 25 yes take this one and do the tracing one by one i want everyone to trace this program i am telling you this program will be asked in so many of companies that is also called as linear search we are using which pattern linear search in that but right now what we are understanding maximum out of the integer Do it, everyone.
Then everyone, I do understood this program quickly. Okay, now I have one more program. Okay, please write down this program also. It's very, very important for your interviews. If you are giving interview means it will come. 100% they'll ask this question. And one more, that is we have done in the array. To find the sum of all the elements present in the array. That one, very, very important. First Avinas find the first largest number, then second we required some extra thing that we'll discuss when those things will be done. Write down this program everyone. Done, done, done. Done, everyone. Yes, we will go for one more program. Let's say M1. Is it visible to everyone? My screen is visible. Yes or no? Is it visible? Depression people. What you guys are having Mandy in your hand today you will not reply. Mm -hmm. 
is it like that yes understood this last program written sir there is a message oh is it like that okay i thought you guys are celebrating rose day yes some trees are there in this bar chapra and chapri yes yes there yes it is there someone is sir i am not chapri sir i am nibba sir so many nibbas are there today they are absent I will know their names also. I saw them in Dangle Chow. Wearing red shirt and uh, blue pant. Okay. Okay. So concentrate on Java. We'll uh, okay. you can see in this main method what is this string args what is this string args can you guys tell me look at the syntax pro string array yes or no how will you access a array if array is there look at there one if this is the array some element are there how will you access the array in the printing statement yes or no what is the syntax array reference variable name followed by the index method signature who who is that before writing uh, don't say mistake and all i know today brain is not working properly what is the name here the name of that for uh, what is that a reference variable is args what is this string it is c int a args how will you access this a a of 0 so sir what will happen sir if i try to access system dot out dot print ln and i will say string not string what i write args of 0 what i will get sir this args is in the main method signature what i will get so i will write m1 and i'll compile the program please have a look on this m1 dot java java m1 what we are getting see this one array index out of bound exception have you seen this exception somewhere yes can you tell me when we are getting this array index out of bound exception sir args sir how we are getting sir okay you tell me right now is there is any value in the command in the args is there is any value in the args no who created args the community that has developed java so sir i have one question can i pass something into this args let's have a look on this if i write java m1 and if i write let's say hi 
and if i press enter what i am getting what i am getting this high will be stored in the zero before that you have not given nothing is there no array is there and you are trying to access the array that is what we are getting array index out of bond exception are you getting what if right now if i try to print args of 1 what i will get error how many of you are sir error we will get sir okay i'll save it first and i'll compile it sorry it's executed i'll compile it java c m1 dot java yes i will write java m1 what we are getting Okay, we will pass hi this time. One more time, let's say hi. You can see for argument zero, we are having something, but for one, do we have something? No. How to pass the arguments in that? no okay for more clarity i will write here add index 1 and here i will write what add index 2 now i will see offer carefully everyone please have a look on this concentrate java c m1 dot java when i am passing argument from command line i am passing argument from command line in the first one i will pass i after that i will pass by can you see that by giving the values from the command line i am using it yes or passing the argument from the command sometimes we pass interval pass argument yes we can use this array which is given in the bin method sir can i pass 1 to the can i pass in possible to pass 12 and 13 everyone is it possible to pass 12 and is it possible to pass 12 and 13 no let's have a look whether it is working or not is it working yes because whatever you will pass it will consider as a string what if you pass character a and b again it will counted as an string everything they counted as a string internally what is doing double quotes in the beginning double quotes in the end are you guys getting this one whatever i am discussing today is with respect of interviews the question that is asked and very less people are able to answer understood you can write this program just a second give heading as how to take arguments from command line and you can do that output as well as the program
write down this one Okay, if you are done, then one more question they will ask. The question that is, can we overload main method? method before that can you guys first tell me what do you mean by method overloading yes yes guys can you tell me what do you mean by method overloading So 
so what is the question can we overload main method okay i'll try to overload that so i'll give the same method what is that method with having same name but different argument i will give the argument as let's say integer okay here i will take let's say one character and i will print here i'll give the proper space just give me a second yes you can see three main methods i have taken method overloading concept is following method consist of same name but different argument so first i will print in that one system dot out dot print event and we'll say what main method i will write like that main method having integer as an argument now system dot out dot print ln i will say main with character as an input and here we'll write system dot out dot print ln we will write main method but string arguments if i execute my program what are the possible scenarios the possible scenarios are that we can get error or any of one of the main method will get executed either the first one or the second one or the last one can you guys tell me what do you think which one will execute giving error what others main method which one tell me the output what is the output you are expecting so i will save this program and again i'll execute it cls java c m1 dot java and i'll execute that program also java m1 which one is getting executed this one yes or no okay one small change i want to do it right now if i want to execute this one will it execute or will it give error then i'll conclude something error what about others how many of these are output will come sir because main method is there sir no matter we are overloading over uh, writing whatever we are doing but output will come sir is there is anyone sir output all are error compile time successful yes how many of sir compile time sir successful sir compile time sir no doubt sir 100% sir swear of my valentine sir compile time it will do sir all right. let me compile that also so i'll write java c m1 dot java you can see this compile time successful and when i execute it it is giving error you can see in this error always whenever main method whenever jvm start calling the main method it will take that main method which is taking the string as an argument string array as an argument understood so no matter what you will write 
main method always execute which one public static void main with the argument string ar gs are you guys getting the concept which main method but can we override what is our answer answer is yes we can override main method also please write this program quickly everyone and also the output of this program fast fast one more thing i want to discuss then i'll wind up the session done okay if you are done with this one have you written this question also it's very very important yes okay now i have one more question my question is if this is my main method sir what sir if i change and change the name to sir uh, something else let's say lela sir will this work will this work or it will always look for args because args is just a name you can give your name also so that will also work clear okay one more thing what is that sir what will happen sir if i write static first sir and void as second sorry static first and public as second what will happen will it give a correct output yes without compiling you are saying yes first let me compile you can see it is still working now you have to check you have to try first void then public and tomorrow you have to tell in what scenarios it is working properly understood you have to try all this and tomorrow you have to tell me that for what change for what combination it is working when i am done remaining three you have to do clear understood 
okay guys so that's all for today we'll see you tomorrow bye bye enjoy valentine day leave the session mm -hmm. <laughs> मुझको कितना बुला मेरा